Okay, Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. This is a topic of uh, stretching. Okay, so stretch this equation. Okay, with the stretch factor, uh, stretch factor a, a can be any number two, three, four, five, six, whatever. The curve equation becomes so whenever okay becomes means when parallel to y-axis, then this equation becomes this one. So actually, what is going on? You can see here. This is multiplied with a. That is, I wrote here. Multiply the whole equation by stretch factor a. So it means when the equation is given by him, what I will do simply multiply and parallel to y-axis. Like this is a y-axis. Okay, I have one equation of curve here, and I want to stretch it. So uh, stretching this way. For example, this diagram it will stretch this way. So it's called parallel to y-axis. This is called parallel to y-axis. For example, this actually graph and will becomes this way. This is called parallel to y-axis stretching. So, and, and he can use this language, he can use the word vertically, is also called vertically. He can use uh, the word x-axis invariant line, x because, because x values will not change in this kind of question. Or y equal to zero is also the same thing. Y is equal to zero invariant line, okay. So both are same, okay. So what to do multiply by a? For example, this question we have, okay. So when I when I will deal this example, stretch uh, 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 this equation four times the parallel to y-axis. So what I will do? I will simply multiply, simply multiply whole equation by multiply equation by 4 okay so answer becomes this way y equal to 4 times to 5 minus half x squared so answer becoming 4 pi to the 20 4 cancel we got a 2x squared so this is an answer and diagram will will uh, I, I don't know exactly what kind of diagram but diagram whatever let's say I assume this assume so this is a diagram for example this and when stretching four times, so what happens? Uh, this answer would be like this, okay? So let's say this is a two, so four twos are eight. It will go on eight. Uh, this height is two, so this become eight because four times. So this is called parallel to y-axis, okay? And x values are not changing at all. You can say that x-axis invariant. X-axis invariant. Invariant means not changing. Invariant means no change, no change. So this is a clear. Let's talk about the rule number two. And rule number two is what we have here. So rule number two, you can see here. So uh, uh, stretch uh, factor A and uh, and uh, with the x-axis. Here parallel to y-axis, here parallel to x-axis. So stretching this way. So it is also called horizontal stretching is also called y invariant now y is not changing at all or uh, y you know what what is the question of y axis x is equal to zero so no problem both are same what is the plan what is the factor given here like i have to do a uh, factor whatever reciprocal it like flip it and replace x with that number multiply for example we have an idea here so if i want to stretch half times parallel to x-axis okay then what i will do i will replace every x by what is reciprocal of this reciprocal one by a one by a means one by half becomes two so replace every x by two x okay so when you replace x by two x so answer becomes so here two x here two x Okay, so 2 square give you 4, x square, minus 6 and minus 5. This is answer. So it, it means, let's say if this stretch vector is is, is, is a 6, 6, okay, if it's 6. So if it's 6 times we have to do, then what is answer? So it becomes 1 by 6. So I will replace every x by, every x by, replace x by, 1 by 6 times 2x. So this is a way. So it means what is given by him the factor, I will reciprocal it. Reciprocal it and that 
multiply with x and I will replace every x and that is technique to do uh, stretch factor that is a technique we have okay Stuart so we have a two examples here 2g and 2g 2c question number and 2e so I wrote a shortcut here when is a parallel to y-axis multiplied by a what factor a parallel to x-axis so multiply by reciprocal replaced by reciprocal of this a and into x circular okay for example, this y-axis. So y-axis, you know, multiply by a. And what factor we have half? So simply multiply it by half. So multiply it by half. So y equal to half times 2, 2 to power x plus 4. So half into 2 to power x and half into 4. So this is coming because power is 1. So 2 to the power x over 2 to the power 1 and this is coming too. It goes up and this is property. So x minus 1, this is our answer for, for question number 2c. Okay, this is x minus 1. Power is x minus 1. Whereas here, and uh, here what we, we have an idea here. So he says stretch parallel to the x-axis by factor 1 by 3. And x-axis, you know, first you, I will do reciprocal. So what is reciprocal of 1 by 3? Let's see. So reciprocal of 1 by 3 is what? So let's see. 1 over 1 by 3, it flips, it becomes 3. So replace every x, replace every x by 3 times 2x. Okay. So let's see what answer comes. So 6 times 2, 3x to power 3, and 36 and 3x. Okay. So 6 times 2 is 27, x to the power 3, and 3, 6 are 18, 9, 1, 0, 8, x. So 7, 6 are 42, uh, 12, so 16. So this is our answer after getting the uh, 1 by 3 times the factor of the uh, stretching.